Hello Forge fans! Summer brings many joys, but foremost to those are the football tournaments that come with it. This time, we want you to help Coach Miller lead her team to victory in this year's Soccer Cup event. If you think soccer should be called football, subscribe to this channel. If not, hit the subscribe button now. As soon as you arrive, you will find your players on the pitch awaiting your instructions. As the team's manager, your objective is to move the ball into the opposition's final third and score a goal. You simply need to chain some passes to get across the pitch until you have the opportunity to shoot and score to win the grand prize reward. However, that will not be your only consideration. Just like in the beautiful game, your players have energy and will get tired with every pass made. But you can replenish it with energy drinks. You can find these energy drinks by completing quests or from regular incidents in your city. You will get also some free energy drinks every day just by logging in. In addition, you will also need to stock up and get acquainted with player cards, as these are the foundation of building a complete team that will dominate in the tournament. During your training, you have the chance to collect additional player cards, and it will either unlock a new player or make one of your current players even stronger. These cards can also be obtained by completing quests and collecting incidents. On the team window, you can have an overview of the players you have collected so far. Adding a new player to your team means you will also be able to pass the ball to this player in the training arena. By clicking on a player card, you can see which rewards you can get by passing the ball to this player. The higher their levels, the higher your chances to get double rewards. You can see the double reward chance on cards of each player. Besides that, we changed the way ranking points are calculated within this year's Soccer Cup event. The higher your team power, the more ranking points you will be awarded from winning your tournament matches. Speaking of which, tournament is the place where you can challenge the teams of other players to climb up in the global ranking. Once you are ready to compete, use your tournament tickets to challenge the teams of other players in the tournament arena. Upon hitting play match, you start off by choosing the difficulty of the match you want to play. Each player has its own strengths and weaknesses, which means that attacking players are more effective against midfielders, while midfielders have advantage against defenders, and finally, defenders are better prepared against attackers. Keep in mind that winning against more difficult opponents will grant you greater rewards. And additionally, you also get more ranking points depending on the difficulty of your opponent. Once you're ready, click on the button in the middle of the screen to use the tournament ticket and see the match results. Tournament tickets replenish over time, offering you one tournament ticket every 8 hours. You can also earn tournament tickets by completing quests, collecting from regular incidents in your city, or purchasing them with diamonds. Winning a tournament match will earn you a reward chest and ranking points, which will determine your global ranking. Each reward chest has a chance to win the tournament daily special, which is different from the training daily special, meaning that on each day there are two different daily special prizes you can aim for. With higher ranking comes better rewards. At the end of the event, you will receive additional special rewards based on your league. You can view which league you are in by clicking on the league trophy in the tournament arena. In addition, the top 10 highest ranked players in the global ranking will get extra rewards based on their rank, including a unique avatar, so make sure that you always gain enough points in order to not fall in ranks. Now let's talk about the new reward. You were waiting for this, right? This year's grand prize is the magnificent Athlon Abbey, an upgradable building with 10 levels for you to admire. This building provides you with happiness, population, and coins on base level. In addition, by leveling it up, the Athlon Abbey will also grant you supplies, medals, forge points, goods, as well as a defense and attack bonus for your defending armies. Woo! Give me a second to catch my breath! Last but not least, the Soccer Cup 2021 will be the first event to have its own dedicated spot in the Event Hub's pier. You can get your hands on this pure edition, which grants a huge boost of 150% supplies production for 5 days by completing Soccer Cup event quests. However, please keep in mind that these boosts will only be activated in your city after the Soccer Cup event is finished. We hope you enjoy playing this year's Soccer Cup event, and there is plenty of silverware in the near future for you. Join thousands of players in our Facebook group and discuss the event there. And of course, if you enjoyed watching this video, make sure to give it a like. See you in game!